part of the video game where you first play and it's hard and you're working it out. playing on the same difficulty level. by doing, by practicing, yes. Why? They are. Good work. Okay, um, my personal view with this approach at the moment is because it, the mission was as a team, so as a team can you try and score the most spectacular goals, yeah. they've still got a part to play even though they're wearing a bib, yeah. because they might be the creator of a goal, or they might win the ball back and then set up a counter attack. Yeah. Also they haven't asked to be challenged, again that was us as coaches thinking oh they've done something I better try and make it different. Yeah, so the person who's got a bid can still be the goal scorer, but then they would just have to give that bid to a teammate. Okay, now that's really important when we're working with kids because we don't want the kid who's... Uh, the kid... Did that touch the bib? If it touched it, you can take it. Okay. Um, it's really important that the person... that. It's really important, sorry guys, that um, the rule is that if you've got a bib, you can still score and achieve a bib for a teammate. Because you wouldn't want the struggling kid to be quite clearly the one that still can't achieve the bib. Yeah. Very good point. Exactly. And they use each other's strengths to achieve the mission. Okay, recognising each other's strengths and weaknesses. I said I wasn't going to pause it, and I haven't. They're letting, I'm letting it play. Okay. So the players? I'm actually not. Um, I don't suspect that they're going to ask to be challenged on the first time of me pausing the game. Uh, if they do, and when they do, yeah, I'm going to have to have something up here. So I think they're going to ask to cheat. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go with... Um, the game's over, okay? It's not being paused, the game's over, okay? Tom! Tom! Boys, just come in! Okay, you just, you just play. 
made that game for a total of probably around six minutes of uninterrupted gameplay. Okay, it's just you and the game. I wasn't coming in and, and affecting you, was I? No, good. By the way, we have, so is it three? Yeah, three. So the blues, I haven't reached your mission yet, but you're on level three, which is good. Okay, yellow, on level one, still in the game, still got five more bibs to get. Okay. By the way, there is a boss level at the end, so if you knock down all of the bibs, there is going to be a, a boss level for you to try and complete as well. All right. Now, <coughs> in your teams, I want you to try and have a chat, decide what you think you need out of these three things in order to be more successful in the game. Okay, so go away in your team. I'll put the tactics board there, and you can decide what you think you need. I've asked both teams to decide, but I'm actually going to only allow one team to use. Um, I'm going to choose the team that are struggling. The other team, I just want you to them to go through the process of actually talking about that and what they think they need. The reason for I couldn't let both teams access it at the same time because it could completely change the makeup of the game a little bit too much. You'll see why in a minute. Okay, time's up. I need you to come and tell me what you need. Um, what do you guys think you need? Change. Okay. Like the way we're we just like shooting, we're not actually aiming for anything. We're just going to change it in like. To give them the trouble, we're going to strip positions over. Okay, so you, you're thinking about changing the way you play? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm actually going to challenge you to rethink about that. So if, if you were going to choose to change, I want you to actually try and change the playing area and the design of how the area looks as opposed to how you're playing. Because I'd like to think that you do that anyway. So I'm giving you an opportunity now to think about. If you were to change the way this kit looks, whether it be the big, the angle of the goals. You can think of it. It help you to get them down. The bottom thing. Do you think it will come off? It's on the floor. It's not on the floor. Okay. Would you like to go and change that? Yeah. Okay. Off you go. Yeah. What, what do you guys think you need? Uh, we we can't choose two. No, let's end on. We need to. We're going to change at the moment. Remember, you can only use it once. So if you're using it now, that's it. It's been used. Oh, okay. Put it off the bottom of the Yeah, yeah. Okay, so just to reiterate, you can only use. I didn't mention this before, that's my fault. You can only use these once. So you've used your change now. Okay. What would you like to use? Change. Why? 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 Because. Yeah. And because of where we usually shoot, uh, we're going to move the bibs so that they are more in the area where we shoot. So we can knock them down easily. Their bibs. Yeah. Your bibs. The ones you're scoring in. Yeah. Okay. okay. You sure? Yeah. Everyone in your team in agreement with that? Yeah. Okay, off you go then. Go and sort it out. Go and change it. I actually changed my mind. I allowed both teams to access it. What are they going to do? Nope. So. Your perception was that they were struggling. But the biggest one was the target to it. That was my perception, yeah. They got a smaller, smaller target. The bibs are closer together, right? Yeah. Yeah. So you think that makes it easier or harder? I think it's the fact that that doesn't ripple like that. that no, no one says that. That's a very good point. Yeah. 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 Very good point. So yeah, they both chose to change. Both teams wanted to change it. Um, that's been done twice now. They, can, they can't use it again. Ah, so um, the blue team changed the bib that they thought they couldn't hit into a place where they thought it would be more likely to get. Um, 
the yellow's copied. So they've also okay, they've which is not. Just, they've also just put the label. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Brilliant. Finding ways of manipulating the rules. Love it. Yeah, brilliant. So now, the next time they come in, they're going to be thinking, I think I'm going to have to cheat due to the fact that those bits are so close together, right? Well, that's what I'm anticipating, we don't know. Okay, let's play! Instead of hitting one bit, you hit like three or four. Would that be exceptional to cheat? Yeah. yeah. I personally, for today's game, yeah. oh. I put down a specific cheat, which is take a player. Oh, it's easy, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> and then what, you get that on your team, you say you got a bummer. Yeah, you got an, you got an uh, overload. Yeah. <laughs> There's a ball in the goal! Can you see them talking? Can you hear what they're actually talking about? Giving information around what you could do in order to finish the ball. The type of finish. Goalkeeper was telling his outfield player. Who's there? Who's there? Oh, scored. Oh, 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 addition to the game for you, alright, so this is going to be a superpower that your team can access when your team have possession of the football, okay, so you'll be playing like you've just been doing, but that will be on the floor somewhere on the pitch, okay, so if your team have the ball, so you've been on the same team and you've just won possession of the ball back, straight away someone from my team can quickly cut the superpower, okay. What that will do is, if the person with the ball and the superpower scores a goal, you automatically can take a bib. doesn't matter if a bib falls down or not. So you get two. So you have two. I just get the one, so. Ah, then you get two, yeah. There's a certain amount of time you can go on that thing. Just until your team then lose possession. So if then if then I get tackled or whatever, I'll just okay I have to drop the bit. It's not mine anymore. Someone from your team can. Yeah, boy, Okay. So exactly the same, we're still on the same levels, level three and level one. Okay? Ready to play? Did you guys hear that? Are you serious? I thought I was speaking loudly. 
Oh. See if you can identify what, what they're doing. I won't tell you, see if you can see what they're doing. It's because your back's towards us, that's why we can't hear you. When you stop yeah, I might have to get them to come all the way over to you. Hmm, might be easier. And I'll stand here. <laughs> you can come round, come round and get close if you want. If you see me doing that. Go back, go back, go back, go back! Don't know about that. Who's got the power? Can you get the power? Good! Get forward, get forward, you've got that power. Drop the bin if you lose possession. You will. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I'll reiterate that again because I know I had my back to you. So the superpower is the red bib. If my team have possession of the ball, someone on my team can pick up the superpower. What that gives you is the opportunity to hit the back of the net and still take a bib, even if the bib doesn't actually fall on the floor. Okay? That's, that's, I gave them that. Yeah, when your team's in possession, you can pick up the power. Yes, yeah, just drop it. Probably. Uh, just anywhere where you see it on the floor. It's like now, you realise that you can pick it up. Because his team had possession of the ball. I think he's a good one, isn't he? Person on the ball. Yeah. But then it challenges them to think about how can they best use this person with the superpower. Well done, fantastic. Get yourself a bib. It hasn't quite fallen off, so you can only take the one. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Did anyone hear what the goalkeeper just said? Take a different one. So they're strategising. Yeah. The key to this, the very good learners will really let the other team a problem. He gave it to him. Doesn't count if he is a side netting. You can put that bit back. Can you get forward? Truly spectacular. Who's got the superpower? Why is it being used? It's quite a difficult skill for them to be able to realise that the power is not being used. So for them to be able to realise we've just won the ball back, where's the power? That's quite a lot to think about. Okay, which is from my perspective is good because I'm really challenging their thinking. Yes, yeah. Oh my what does the superpower also do for the players that are maybe struggling in this game? Yeah, it gives them a chance to actually feel what success uh, might be like. Um, because actually, even if they don't get a bid, they're still getting some success because of the superpower. Time. 
Brilliant boys, good work. Very good. I've been informed by the coaches that I've uh, I'm blocking their view a little bit, so I'm going to stand this side. Okay. Um, shall we shuffle a bit that way so they can hear us? Because I'm a bit conscious, I'm a little bit quiet. Okay. So coming close. Um, you guys managed to get up to level four in there, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Which is good. Was that from the superpower? Yeah, yeah. Who was it that, that was successful? Um, can you talk, talk me through when you picked up that power, how you used it? Going forward, you're attacking. You got any attacking towards the line. Okay. Good. I, I saw you make a really good forward run when you got it. You were very brave and you just said, oh, I, don't, I don't care, I'm going to try it. And you did a little good one. A really good one. Okay, so to use this, it's really, really effective. It's going to help you in the game. Okay, be brave. Pick it up and go for it. Okay. Um, you've both used the opportunity to change the game. All right. So you both now have an opportunity to either use cheat or challenge. Do you know what the cheat is? No. The cheat is that you can take a player from the other team. Okay. The challenge is something that I will set your team. Okay. It might not be the same. I might set you a specific challenge and I might set you guys a specific challenge. So you can go away now, really quickly, 30 seconds, and decide what you want. Yeah, guys, would you like to go and get yourself a quick drink first? Yeah? Okay, I'm going to go drink. And then when you come back, you can let me know what you've chosen. Yeah? What time do you get out of here, chap? So we've been playing... We've been playing for 25, plus 20, 45 minutes of play. It's probably only been stopped. I reckon we started about 10 past. Or 40 minutes of gameplay. Oh, going smaller. 35 minutes of gameplay, um, and probably stopped. I'd say over five minutes if you added up all the counts. Um, but we're looking at 75% full, full rolling concept. I think you can maximise that even more in this type of practice. You can get it really high up because you could do just like 10 minutes gameplay and then bring them in. I've been doing slightly smaller just because I'm here to help these guys, not necessarily them. Exactly. It's going to be a change that probably use your change. Yeah, no, could have done that. could have, yeah. The coaches on the side actually wondered why you hadn't. Yeah, Because yeah. they could see quite clearly that it's much easier to score down there. We have to, like, swap up into it we get them. So what have you decided to use? Challenge or cheat? Challenge. You want to challenge, eh? You're not opting yeah, for the no. cheat? No. No, we're going to say that's a tactical one. Okay, you might not have time then. Do you want a challenge? Yeah. Okay, your challenge is, as a team, can you try to make clever combinations? What does that mean, clever one combinations? Two, one, two. Could be a one-two. Good, yeah. Can you try and make clever combinations before you finish? Okay, and I want to see a three different types of combinations. Is that like okay. a condition so we can only score if we do that? No. Oh, okay. It's just a challenge. Can you try? Oh, okay. okay. I'll yeah? Smash it in yeah. the back of the net as well. <laughs> so what do you smash? Don't, don't, don't. You can still do a smash in the back of the net, yes. So you, you, it's just a challenge for you, uh, okay? Yeah. What have you gone for? Challenge. Really? Yeah. You don't want to cheat? We want to cheat. cheat. We think, no, you know, you've only got five minutes until it ends. I don't think cheat. 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 This is our last I round. I don't want to cheat. Yes, this is the last round. Yeah, this is probably going to be the last round. Yeah, but do you really want to win by cheating? Yeah. Yeah, why not? <laughs> 10, 9, 8, right, 7, challenge. 6. Challenge. Okay. Uh, challenge is, can you try to score
but that's your challenge. Can you oh, try to? If we do, if we do, if we do, if we get, can't get anything. Oh. If, if we do, if we do, if we do, did they use cheese? No. Okay, let's go. Go. We can get it. Interesting, they both opted not to use the cheat. Who was the cheat? Uh, to take someone else's player and put them on your team. Oh, I'm going to get yeah. that. They both use the same What's the challenge? The cheat. Yeah. I, in the past, I haven't allowed both teams to utilise them both at the same time because just I thought it might get a bit difficult for myself to keep up with. Um, but today, I guess because they're a bit older than what I used to work with, it's been fine. What's the challenge? Yeah. Did they pick the challenge? They picked, I told them the challenge in fact. Um, though if I was better planned I could have definitely had a choice and they could have picked one. Probably a better idea. So what the um, So set the blue team, can you try and score from inside the six yard box? Yeah. Um, well, <coughs> <laughs> by hitting the bin. Well, quite a bad mate in here Amy, but yeah. that's not just your benefit if you've got a team of defenders oh, against team yeah. attackers. Yeah. Yeah. The blues are defenders? All defenders. Okay, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> and then the other team's challenge was to try and um, um, show me as many combinations as you can. So I, I said, can you show me at least three types of combinations before you finish? Are the going to score in the t sharp box? Yes. Well, they, no, it's not that they can't only, it's can you try to. Uh, but they can still score from anywhere. Right. But okay. yeah. Do you think they want to put them on the side? They've got no attackers in the team. Can you define combinations? Yeah, we spoke about um, what it could look like and their, what do you think their first example was? One two. One two, yeah. So one two, we had... It's not... Say again? Like, that's... You know, I think if you said that, what's the combination of one two, that's usually one two. One two, yeah, of course, yeah. Like, that's what they said, yeah. Yeah, we did it last night with the girls, actually, and they said exactly the same thing. Yeah, so they said uh, one two, and I said, can you think of any more? Someone said triangles. Yeah. Um, someone said overlaps. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that's the type of thing I'm looking for. I didn't go into a lot of detail around how they might do it, I just said, that's their pictures, you go for it, type of thing. No, no, he's on. He's on the um, the team defending that goal. Sorry, the team shooting in that goal. Because that shows the levels, the levels that they're on. Yeah, no, it's my, my fault, my fault. Hello. Yeah, you get some money. Thank you. Um, I'll be off on the dot. Superpowers back in the game! Again, keep trying. As many times as you can from inside there. Oh, lovely scoop. That forward run into the six yard box, brilliant. Can you get forward? Is that super power? Can you get forward? 
good. Good. There's two superpowers in there now, just to try and add up a little bit more opportunity to, to get that final bid for the blues, but to get back in the game for the yellows. Still, only if you've got possession. Only if you've got possession can you pick up the powers. Look at the forward runs that these powers create are really, really good. Very good finish, and we've got a superpower getting a big. Not quite. And time, okay, boys, come over. We've got only a very short period of time left. Um, Blues, so you did fantastically well with your superpower there. Okay. Um, you now are to the boss level, Blues. Okay, what was your team challenge? Okay, so for the boss level, the team challenge is to score inside the box, the box. However, that person who scores has to be the person with the superpower in their hand. Okay, you guys are still on the that you're at presently. Um, I would urge you to try and pick up both the superpowers that are lying on the pitch as soon as your team is back possession of the ball, because that will definitely help you try and get more success on there. Okay? Ready to play? We're playing now, let's go, let's go, let's go. So they're on the boss level, which is just the hardest part of the game, the most complex problem. The boss level I call it. Uh, the challenge is um, their team challenge, which I'd set them before, which they asked for, which was to score inside the six yard box. Yeah. However, it has to be the person holding the superpower that actually scores that goal. Uh, is that the boss level? That's, that's the boss level. Boss it has. So, in a video game, you have um, at the end of a level, you have like the hardest part of it. So, if I give you Sonic as an example, when you got to the end, you then have to face like the big, big baddie who's like really difficult to beat. A really tough problem to solve. I don't know about that guy. Yeah, so. It's all right. Beauty, yeah. that was a I love to. Yeah. We've got that upstairs we've now. Got we've got a tournament. <laughs> we've got a tournament. We've got a tournament. We've got a tournament. We've got a tournament. We've got a Last minute! Last minute! Thirty right. seconds! Can you do it? Look at them throwing the power. Look at them now throwing the superpower to a teammate. Do you see that? They're now starting to understand how to best utilise that power. They realised there wasn't much time left, so they lobbed it to someone who was high up the pitch. Huh. What's it got to do with football? Yeah. From them? No. Yeah. Well, it's just a match. I think they just see it as football, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The power, we need the power. Remember, remember what the boss level is. Let's go, ball in, let's go. The last ball, Georgie. This is the last ball of the game. Right, right, right now, right now. Where are the powers? Jake down. Yeah. Take it. Take it. Could have been a good ball there for the guy with the superpower as well. Time! And 
good time. Great work. Very, very good. Everyone come in. So. Real close. So we're going to save the game at that point. Okay, so if I had the pleasure of coaching you again this time next week, we'd come back to this point in the game. Okay, because food, you haven't quite fulfilled the mission, have you? Because you didn't get past the boss level. And yellows, you've got, still got the one bib. Okay, however, at the end, the use of your superpowers was much better. You're picking up the power and you're running forward and you're trying to get down to the other side of the pitch, which is fantastic. Um, you've both not opted to cheat. Why was that? Just out of interest. Go on. I don't know. Like when you win, you don't really like feel like you've won when you've cheated. Brilliant. Okay. Why else? Was there any other reasons from anyone else? Just out of interest. Do you think now yellow is based upon the situation where you're on level one and the other team are on a higher level? Do you think you might need to cheat? Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> so who would you have picked to, to join your team? William. Why would you have picked William? Because he's, 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 he's fast and he's powerful. He's fast and powerful and for this he's good because he's got the bibs off by hitting the ball hard. Much. Okay. So that, was your, that might have been a strategy to get success in terms of powering the ball into the back of it. Good. Can I just also highlight yellow? Um, you know you opted to change the game, but it was only until later you realised you, you actually thought of a better change. Yeah. Can you tell the other team what you wish you had have done? Change, change sides. Then we were sitting that way. Is it? Is it? Oh, it would have been much better. Oh, yeah. okay, well, I'm thinking, um, um, if we could have swap bibs. Yeah, swap sides. Swap bibs. They would have been at a higher level. Because it was quite a lot easier to score in that goal, Blues, wasn't it? Yeah. Would we have had to like swap our bibs? Yeah, we could have just done that quickly. Yeah. Yeah. So if we were to play that again, you can think of all the different types of things that you might do next time. Yeah. Great work, guys. Thank you very much for having us. If you could um, you. take your bibs off, no problem, and just leave them on the side. Thank you. No worries. No problem. Good work. Thank you. Good. Good to see you all. Thank you. Thank you. Good Cheers, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you very much. Um, coaches, we're going straight back inside because I'm conscious that. Um, You've got another part of the session. Andrew's inside waiting for you, I think. Okay? We can talk about it inside. Yeah. So, you could, so every every time it stops, you could choose one of them? Yes. Yeah. But not the same okay. one twice. Yeah, it can't yeah. use the same so one So once twice. you use your cheat, you've only got the two left. Exactly. Yeah. Um, and that do you want to help with anything, by the way? Um, no, I'll, I'll do it, only because I'm conscious that Andy from Coach Logic is in the classroom waiting to talk with you. Um, so yeah, I'll sort out with you quickly, I don't want you to waste your time. No, thank you, because I've got to shoot. Okay, no worries. No problem at all. No worries, okay, see you later. And we're setting up this year's one in June, uh, and the whole thing that we're sort of doing is, is it's, 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 it's never what you think, like you've got two goals.